What up? What up? What up? It's your man's in them. The blood print. You watching Tay Pain 909 Live. Man, I, French Montana. French Montana. What's the what's the draw to this dude, man? I don't see it. But let's get into his story though. He say he would have signed with uh good music, Kanye's label, or he couldn't you know what I'm saying? He would have talked to him, but he couldn't get in contact with him. Um, because he didn't have his phone number. He don't have a phone. He says Kanye West does not have a phone. You have to email him if you want to talk to him. I find that a tad bit hard to believe. Because I, I, I'm sure Def Jam can get in touch with him whenever they want to. I'm sure Jay-Z can get in contact whenever he wants to. You know what I'm saying? I, I don't think, I, I'm sure Common and the rest of these guys can get in contact. His roster can get in contact with him. You know what I'm saying? Business people can get in contact with him if he got business going on. But he doesn't have a phone. Get out of here, French Montana, man. This is like the second thing from really, li from really listening to you. Man, this is like the second thing this guy has said that was like, come on, man. Like, I can't. When he said $250,000 for the house, I was done. $250,000, big ass house. I was done. I was done with him right then there. Not to mention, his music wasn't that great to me. But that just furthered it. Now, this even furthered it because you're not even... French Montana, first of all, let's get it. Let's not make no mistake about it. Man, he was a world star rapper. That's it. He didn't say nothing impactful. He's never said nothing impactful that has changed in anything. I mean, he's a world star rapper, man. He's average at his very best. So I don't understand what's the big deal with him. But Kanye not getting him not having Kanye's number, I can understand that. Like, if I was Kanye, I wouldn't give him my number either. Kanye knows he's not on the level, man. He's a flash in the pan rapper. He's going to be done. He's going to be out of here like, give him like three years, two, three years. He's out of here, man. So, I mean, you actually shocked that Kanye didn't jump on that. And then good music and French Montana just don't mix anyway. Let's be real about it. Like, French Montana and Maybach music and Bad Boy, yeah, okay, whatever. Because you already know the Bad Boy curse, um, hip-hop artists. Rappers in the bad boy um, under the uh, the bad boy umbrella never works out. Um, always fails. That's the I think that's the biggie, the biggie curse, or what have you. But uh, yeah, it's never gonna work out there for any uh, any rapper because P Diddy is all about himself at the end of the day. You know what I'm saying? Look at Young Jock. Look at uh, uh, what's the other guy's name? Black Rob, uh, G Dep, uh, man, Loon. I mean, the list goes on and on. Mace, the list goes just on and on and on. So, I mean, but what do you, how do you, man, how do y'all feel about French Montana? French Montana, real talk. Like, I don't see the big deal. Tell me what's the big deal about him, and then we can go from there. Let's lay up. Peace out.